सो हाई डियर कैंसर अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टेरो एंड दिस इज जनरल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द कैंसर सन मून विन राइजिंग Keep in mind, this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed. Also, third thing, this is a reading from 11 till the 21st of August for singles only. Okay, I'm going to tap into your current energies. I will see your energies for a new person, and then I will see your energies for a past person that you are still stuck on and the guidance. Cancer. Let's see your current energies right now at this present moment. Let's see. Just give me a second, ma'am. we have the 10 of wands a world card and a four of cups bottom of the deck is a three of swords so you are very much in pain right now also there is something very very painful going on in your life you are trying your best to heal from that pain let go of something or someone out of your system out of your life but i think you are not able to do that because see you are trying your best to let go of the like uh, burden some kind of situation heavy kind of situation or a breakup or separation or something that uh, you felt like uh, you are not able to handle anymore you are trying your best to put an end to that but at the same time you are stuck on the same person on the same energy for some of you are stuck on a particular person for some of you are stuck on a particular experience and because of that experience because of that feeling that you are still carrying within yourself you are not able to move ahead in your life you are not able to connect with new people new situations so it's like something is very burdensome that you are trying to put an end to but you are not able to do that because you are still stuck on something or someone here okay and it's very very painful for you to carry around with these energies but you are anyway doing it because you can't force yourself to heal right you cannot force the healing process you cannot force the letting go process it's going to take time and you know this so you're trying your best to be uh, normal try trying your best to be uh, patient in the situation but at the same time you are getting a little bit uh, uh, like uh, confused and a little bit like off here yeah stuck here let's see what are your energies for a new person on your connection if somebody new is adding up in your life the strength card the ace of swords six of cups bottom of the deck is the eight of wands see i don't see a new person new energy to be honest i do see someone is holding back this urge to connect with you again and this is a past person who wants to have a brand new beginning with you they want to clarify each and everything with you the past person wants a brand new beginning with you this is the situation here now it could be very much possible that this is someone who re whom you rejected in the past or you guys used to be friends with each other uh, at some point of time or you were just in connection with each other at some point of time but things didn't worked out and you ghosted them they ghosted you there was complete silence now somebody wants to break their silence here and they want to restart again with proper clarity proper honesty and they want to have a reconciliation with you now it's a past person that's what that wants to come back to you that wants to have a, a like lot of clarity lot of honesty in the situation they want to talk to you they want to talk to you like a lot of lot of clarification lot of conversation heart to heart conversation face to face meeting and they want to have a reconciliation with you and this is somebody who knows you you guys had a history together it's not all like always the like the per person that you are completely stuck on it could be someone from your past you guys had a memory together you guys you know this person and they are trying to come to your life and you know who we are talking about when i'm talking to you regarding this person so it's a past person but they want to come towards you with a new and fresh energy with a clean slate this is what i'm getting here for you guys it could be a cancer pisces scorpio gemini libra aquarius a leo or aries leo sagittarius even if it is not just go with the energies not with the signs only let's see the person that you're stuck on that uh, the person that you want in your life back let's see what are their energies towards you the person that you want uh, back in your life we have the two of swords the four of wands and the three of pentacles they are not sure the past person is not very much sure about uh, you know coming toward coming back towards you might be you guys are not able to talk to each other from a very long time let's say for some of it's like 6 uh, to 8 months and they might be thinking that you are having somebody else in your life and that you are already married or engaged or at least you have someone else in their life in your life with whom you have a very solid committed kind of relationship with so they are not sure whether you are available or not and that is why they are not able uh, to take any kind of uh, initiative from their side or they are not taking any kind of action from their side 
because they are not at all sure if you are single or if you are married or hitched or engaged or you are with someone or you are like you are having someone in their life or not so they are so they are making up the stories in their mind and they are uh, getting very confused and conflicted about the situation so they are not doing anything about it it's like uh, everything is up in the air everything is conflicted everything is confused so let me not do anything about it for some of you they are not coming back towards you because they know that if they are going to come back to you you are going to ask for commitment marriage long term partnership okay and they might not be ready for that that is why they are holding back mm -hmm. wow this is someone who is feeling a strange kind of love and strange kind of emotions towards you their heart chakra is opening up towards you uh, again out of nowhere so you might be manifesting this person or you might be missing this person like crazy and they are getting the energies from your side so they are feeling a strange kind of pull towards you but at the same time they are not sure what's going on in your life that's why they are silent and that's why they are not taking any kind of action let's see what is the guidance for you guys in the situation cancer We have the Queen of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles. You have to be very, very clear in your thoughts, in your actions, in your uh, like uh, decisions in your life. So if you want some solid, committed relationships or some kind of, you know, happily ever after kind of energy, then you should talk to the person about that very honestly and openly. But if you just want a casual connection and you just want to go with the flow and take your time and all this thing, then also you have to be very, very clear with the other person, other energy here. And the vice versa. So if somebody is coming towards you, even if the past person or new energy, you have to be very, very clear about what you really want from them so that uh, you, you are not going to get hurt in the future or they are not going to get hurt in the future. So clarity is very, very important for you in love and relationship area for this time. Okay. Yeah. So thank you so much for tuning in cancer. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.